Hello YouTube, I'm David with the David West channel. Well, if you remember my last video on this channel, we harvested a big piece of mullein. and it was kind of old and cracked up and I ended up just using the pith out of it, but I cut this 12 inch section off and told you that when it dried out, we would try it for a bow drill spindle. So I have not had it in the house. It's just been drying in the garage, so that's not 100% dry and it's got some very deep cracks in it but let's go ahead and try it for bow drill spindle uh, the way we'll barren block it I cut the spout off of a, an aluminum Budweiser can and captured a quarter all the way up against the, the cap up in there so that's going to help about not wearing through this real thin aluminum this is a great way to barren block any stalk type weed or plant. So we use uh, pine needles. So I got the pine needles right here in my pocket. I sort of want to just show you sort of behind the scenes. And I'll set the camera up right here. All right, I'm just going to reuse this uh, crepe myrtle fireboard. You can get a mullen spindle to do its own burn in, but it is difficult. So I have some nice big notches and divots here. We'll just reuse those. But uh, what I want to do, look at how crooked that thing is. So I'm going to see how much I could take off on this side, how much I could take off on that side and maybe just straighten that out and just do the best I can to straighten that spindle up. I have to be careful which way I carve it because I do not want to peel a big long strip off. Now, let's get this right here. Still pretty crooked. And that's crooked. I think I'm gonna go ahead and take off. I'm just gonna to have to take this part off right here. I like a long spindle, that's why I tried to save it. We still have about eight inches there. Now, I'm gonna take these 90 degree corners off because this is the end right here that's going up in the bearing block. Up into our custom 25 cent bearing block. We're ready to give it a try. <laughs> it's still pretty crooked, so it's going to make some noise as we're spinning it around.
go ahead and go for this divot here. It's a whole lot deeper. It can capture the spindle better. Something that did not appear usable when we harvested it from the side of the road because it was saturated, wet, and so crooked, we was able to utilize the pith out of most of the plant and actually make a bow drill spindle out of another eight inches of the plant. So this is a good way to bend and block a, any kind of a stock type spindle. All right, y'all. Worked out pretty good, didn't it? I appreciate you joining me on this one. We'll catch you on the next one. You see Yo-Yo down there? Watch him. I didn't even see you sneak up them stairs. How did you do that? Come on in here. <laughs>